We're back with Chaz Bono, and we have somebody on the phone right now. Okay. Hello? Hello? Cher? Yeah? It's your mama. Hi, Cher. Hi, sweetheart. How are you? I'm fantastic. How are you? I'm good. All right. Well, I got to, uh, I, I, I would assume you, uh, I, I was just saying to Chaz how brave, what a brave human being. You must be so proud of how brave he is. I am. You know, this is, <laughs> Chaz and I actually talked about this several times over the years, and then nothing happened. And, and in one way, I thought, oh, God, this is going to be so terrible. He's going to have to go through so much. But, you know, the way he's handled himself and, um, I mean, you know, my child is a wonderful child. Thank you. Yes. Yes. As, as a mother, I can't imagine uh, feeling uh, the, the frustration when you, when you hear the criticism that's going on around your child. You know, I, I, I have, we had a conversation, and I said, there are many people who will just never, ever understand. They won't take the time. They will just, they'll just hold up their hand and say, no, I don't want to know about it. I don't understand it. I don't like it, whatever. But there are more people, I think, especially after they hear Chess talk, that will just think, oh, what a lovely person, you know, not, you know. And also, like, I tried to explain it to someone who just wasn't getting it. And I said, you know, I really love being a girl. I love frilly things. I love makeup. I love, you know, new pair of Prada shoes. I love everything that's girly, you know. If I woke up in the morning and I wasn't a girl, Boy, I would be at the first doctor. I would just make, I would make a laundry list and be at the first doctor and go, this is not happening for me. So I can't imagine how you live your whole life knowing that something's not right for you and having to live that way. I just think that's such a sad thing to have to go through your life and have people not accept you for who you are. You've, you've got to, I, and I have to hear this just because, you know, I adore when you speak your mind. And uh, I just want to hear your thoughts on people that are saying, that, that they should boycott uh, the show, that they, they're asking people not to watch Dancing with the Stars. What would you say to them? You know, I, I don't know if people are that determined and they are going to use, you know, if you've got that excess time and that amount of hostility, I'm not so sure that I could say anything to you that would make you change your feelings, you know, because those are such feelings of hostility and fear that I don't know, like, that I would have any magic words that could make you feel more comfortable and to, you know, soothe you into not being terrified if my child dances on Dancing with the <laughs> Stars. There you go. 